We've installed 6,000 solar panels across the roofs and car parks of the university. When the sun shines, we produce chill water, store that chill water in the tank, which in turn saves 40% of our energy consumption from the grid. Working with universities have enabled us to learn the, the multifaceted approach to sustainability encompassing economic sustainability as well as environmental sustainability. Looking around today and seeing the engagement in this project, I think I realise that we have pulled off a major infrastructure project which is going to save a lot of energy from the grid and also ask people about what we're going to do next to continue the journey. Less than 30% of even private businesses innovate together. And now we're talking about a university as a public institution and a private institution like Veolia globally working together to put in place something like this. So it's pretty uh, amazing uh, what we're getting to uh, experience here. But it's the way in which we've gone about it to set it up a complete teaching and learning facility within that environment and delivering that project to enable us to show that it can be done and set it up to, as a teaching and learning tool. For engineering, students need to understand how to store energy and this is a way to store energy. They see the solar panels on the roofs, they see the thermal chiller and it's just something that they will see in their everyday lives at university. We looked at sustainability in very many aspects in that the way in which we use the water from the lakes, we treat that and use it in the cooling process. We removed a boardwalk to put the tank in. We used the timber from that boardwalk, we recycled that timber and used it in the bench in the control room. The sediment pond, which was part of the building process, had to be there for the first 12 months to catch the sediment during the building process. We've actually turned that into a permanent ongoing feature to attract the wildlife onto the site so that it can be used. Well, in terms of sustainability, we, uh, we walk the talk. Sunshine Coast Council aims to be the most sustainable local government authority in Australia and we're very happy to support that mission. There is a huge amount of excitement, yeah, that this can be achieved and this can be replicatable through other universities and other, other organisations. I see this project, whilst being extremely satisfying to getting it to completion, I believe it's just the beginning of the university's journey towards its 2025 goals of carbon neutrality.